Felipe Rojas Alou was born on May 12, 1935, in the Dominican Republic. He played for six different teams and later managed two of the teams he played for. He was the first Dominican to play regularly in the big leagues. Felipe played alongside two of his brothers, managed a son, and saw another one of his sons manage the New York Mets. He played 17 years in the majors, including six with the San Francisco Giants and six with the Braves in Milwaukee and in Atlanta. He also spent time with the A's, Yankees, Expos, and Brewers. He played all three outfield positions and twice led the National League in hits and once in runs scored. Twenty times he led off a game by hitting a home run. Alou was signed in November 1955 by the New York Giants for $200, and he made his Major League debut on June 8, 1958, at age 23. He played sparingly in his first three seasons in San Francisco. Felipe was joined by his brothers Matty in 1960 and Jesus in 1963, and on September 15th of that same year, became the only all-brother outfield ever in the majors. His first all-star season came in 1962, the same year that he played in the postseason for the first time, where the Giants lost to the Yankees in seven games. He was traded to the Braves just before the 1964 season. In 1966, he finished second in the batting race, his brother Matty finishing ahead of him. He also finished fifth in MVP voting that year. At the end of his playing career, he joined the Montreal Expos organization becoming a batting coach and a minor league manager. He managed in West Palm Beach, Memphis, Denver, Wichita, and Indianapolis in A, double A, and triple A ball from 1977 to 1991 before finally getting his chance with the Expos in 1992 becoming the first Dominican-born manager in Major League Baseball. He managed players such as Larry Walker, John Wetland, Delino DeShields, Petro Martinez, Vladimir Guerrero, his nephew Mel Rojas, and his son Moises with the Expos. In 1994, the Expos had the best record in baseball, at 74 wins and 40 losses when the mid-August strike eventually canceled the entire postseason, denying the team the chance to get to their first World Series. 1995 saw the Expos cutting payroll by dealing most of their young talent away, but he was with the team until they fired him in 2001. The Dodgers had tried to lure him away in 1998, but he had chosen to stay in Montreal and would eventually become their most successful manager ever. He retired after his firing, but the Boston Red Sox came calling, but Felipe resisted their overtures. He finally returned in 2003 to manage the Giants and promptly led them to 100 wins before losing in the playoffs to the Marlins. He retired from managing in 2006, but remained with the Giants as a special assistant to the general manager. Alou has been married four times, the first three ending in divorce, and he's had 11 kids, including Moises and Luis Rojas, 
who managed the New York Mets. Please come again to my channel for more vintage baseball players.